Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Timmy Treacle, also known as Horror Fan for Life. And the next review I have for you guys is called Choose or Die. And it was released on April 15th, 2022. It is a British horror film that has a 4.7 out of 10 on IMDb, a 30% on Rotten Tomatoes, and a 61% on Google. Well, this movie was directed by Toby Meekins and is directorial debut and written by Simon Allen and the movie stars Lola Evans, AJ Butterfield and Robert England and in this movie it is about um, after a uh, uh, lost 80s survival horror game uh, goes unplayed for years a young uh, uh, coder unleashes the hidden curse that tears up uh, reality uh, and forcing her to make uh, terrifying decisions that face deadly consequences. Uh, basically in this movie uh, something comes up on the computer and she's got to make a choice. There's two options. Uh, and generally whatever she chooses turns out to be deadly. And uh, yeah, that's what this movie is about. To me, this movie is, it's, anything with computers and stuff, it's, it's like it's, it's been done before, but they're trying to do it in a different way by inventing this 80s game that, um, it, uh, says it offers the prize of $100,000 if you complete, uh, everything within the game, and it, even that, it, it's just, I don't know. It just it just seems like this has uh, been done before, and yeah, it's been done a little bit different. But at the end of the day, it's just it's just an okay movie. I will say I, I do like the kills in the movie. I thought they were really fascinating, uh, and some of the characters were really good. Um, outside of that, though, this was just an uh, an average horror movie to me, in my opinion. Uh, you know, I'm always excited to see uh, new horror movies, uh, especially ones coming out uh, this year. Uh, but it, it just, I don't know, could have been a lot better, let's just put it that way. Uh, but it wasn't terrible. Uh, the writing uh, was okay. The directing for being a debut <clears throat> was okay as well. But outside of that, though, there's nothing really else to say about this movie. Uh, with that, I will give Choose or Die a 6 out of 10. Uh, no thumbs up, no thumbs down, just a 6 out of 10. Uh, just an average horror movie. Uh, it was uh, released by Netflix. Uh, if you're looking for something new to watch, I guess I can recommend it. Uh, and you guys just judge for yourself, you know. Uh, but if you've seen the movie, you know, let me know what you thought about it. I would love to hear some feedback from you guys. And uh, just make sure you keep the comments uh, PG and no name calling or anything like that. But let me know what you guys thought about the movie. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell. Uh, and if you like this review, hit that like button. Share this review on your social media as you see fit to. Uh, but other than that, like I said, I give it a 6 out of 10. And uh, I thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for many more movie reviews. And check you later.